So in order to get the physical tickets, we have to take our passports and we have to be both here. So you have to prepare your passports and you also have to be there physically to get your tickets even after you book online. So after they've checked their passports, now they are checking the reservation number. はい、あとえっとネットでもえっと新幹線のセキの予約がします。はい。で、スタートデイインセプテンバー23 so we're taking the JR East pass. Mainly we're going to be traveling around Akita and Yamagata. 20,000 yen for the JR East pass. Okay, you can use this uh, uh, 20, September 23rd to September 27th. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's a free screen. Yes. Ticket guidance. If you use reasonable sheet, uh, please go to JR ticket office uh, bin, bin to make yeah. seat reservation. Okay. All right. Okay. okay. Mm. So when you lose these, um, they're not going to give you another one. And you always have to take your passport with you all the time too, in case they ask. We're going to be taking 656 one Komachi Hayabusa. Akita! Take it! Yeah, we just have to find our car, our car. Find your car and just look on the floor. This is car number 14. The past one was 13, so you just have to go all the way there until you find number 16. Car number 16 to Akita. Here we go. This is what's inside the Shinkansen. Five AB. Five AB. We're sitting here. You can put your drink right here. There's also this table similar to when you're riding a plane. Yeah. This Shinkansen actually looks kind of old, right? Yeah. <laughs> One of the things you must do, sanitize. If you hear that sound, it means someone pressed the SOS button apparently. Our first stop is the Akita Citizens Market. It's only seven minutes walk from Akita Station. We're doing this because for the first day here in Akita, we don't have a car. We might have a car tomorrow. <laughs> We're still waiting for the confirmation of the car rental company where we booked. Alright, well, Akita version. Goes up for 400 yen up to 500 yen. Vending machine for gyoza. We are here at Akita Citizens Market. We're gonna try to find food here for lunch. One thing I've noticed about this Akita Citizens Market, so We've been to a lot of markets, but this is the first time that I've seen so many t tables and chairs where, you know, shoppers can rest and eat. Such as this, 
This is very thoughtful of them, Akita people. We're heading back to the station to go to go to one of the restaurants I saved. Look at this! Um, it's the famous Inaniwa Soba from Izawa, uh, southern part of Akita. And by the way, this is one of the Japan's top three udon, Inaniwa udon. And 1,800 yen for this meal. So I feel like we're hitting two birds with one stone here in Satoyosuke. Apparently, Miku's meal, this, has Hinaiji Dori chicken, which is also one of the three Japan's top three chicken breeds. Yep. Satoyosuke. We're heading to Akita Dog Station. And at the same time, it's on the way, same way as Akita Museum of Art. So, Manhole, perfect for Akita. They're known for their lanterns here. Some kind of art here. By the way, for those who don't know, this yellow thing is... It's an accessibility feature that's very common here in Japan, which I really, really love. So this is where, you know, people with, what do you call them? Visually impaired people can find their way all the way. And they're everywhere here in Japan. Yep, just a fun fact. I'm attracted to beautiful interior design. Akita Museum of Art, just right next to Akita Dog Station. Found the Akita Dog Station where you can, you know, play with Akitas. But apparently they're closed for today, so they told us to come back tomorrow, which is Saturday from 11 a.m. This is Akita Museum of Arts freestanding staircase and its triangular skylight. The museum is an art, work of art itself. It's designed by a Japanese architect named Tada Ando. He's a famous architect here in Japan. If you're carrying big bag, a big backpack like I do. You can use their locker room. The lockers you can use for free. You just have to, you know, insert 100 yen and you can get it back later when you pick up your bag. So to lock, just insert the coin. And then we have the key. Ta-da! Then you'll get your 100 yen later. This is the museum's cafe. You can drink coffee while looking outside the window. It's to the Museum of Art. Akita Museum of Art costs 1,000 yen per person. And look! They have riff magnets. Very cute cat riff magnets. 1,500 yen each. This is only 500 yen. Getting this. Um, hi, I'm getting this pouch made by a sweet Japanese lady. Look, it has a lot of pockets. And you can even put cards in here. It's 1,600 yen. Also, she also has this pouch for medicine. You can put your receipts here maybe or whatever you call that thing that you need to get from doctors and then you can put your medicine right here. Lovely place for local artists selling their creations. But there are books here too, secondhand books. And right here they sell secondhand clothing and other stuff. They even have dried flowers here. And that's where the pottery is! Beautiful creations, but you know we're at the start of our journey. It cannot be 
carrying things that can get broken, that can break. I don't know why, but every time I see scone, homemade scones, I always feel the need to buy it. So we got this for 250 yen, right there. We're also getting babahira ice for 200 yen. So affordable. Color chart for Faro and Ball. Thank you so much. This is a British um, brand for yeah, paint. Yes. Okay. This is Century Park. And in this park, there's this beautiful tree. I don't know what kind of tree, tree it is, but it's very beautiful. Let's go. Kanto Festival coffee, Japanese towel, cloth paper, and cloth wrapper. Akita City Folk Art Center. Paying 260 yen and we can. That's entrance fee for old Kaneko family house, Neburi Nagashikan. We're here right now. And Akarenga. So three locations for 260 yen per person. locals here during the festival they either put it on their forehead or on their shoulders or also put them on their back close to the butt you can try carrying it but you have to ask the staff this one's really big and it's the third biggest look at the others <gasps> To the old Kaneko family house and you don't have to exit just go right through here when entering old houses especially you always have to take off your shoes sometimes they even require you to wear socks Akita Municipal Akarenga Khan Museum or Red Brick Museum and it actually takes only five minutes from old Kaneko house. It's not seven minutes, just five minutes. Let's go. This Red Brick Museum used to be a local bank here and this one inside is... It used to be a former vault. This is where they store the money from a long time ago. to Chawanya. We're probably gonna have um, Kiritampo here which is one of the local dishes here in Yamagata, no Akita. So we'll see! Chawanya! Here we 
you go, chillin' y'all. This is Kiritampu. And we have some Hinaya chicken as well right here. This sugar butter. 450 yen and choco banana custard for 550 yen. This place is very close to Chawanya. So after your meal, you can go here for dessert. Sugar butter, 450 yen. It's very hot. Banana choco the smoking room. If we have any other choice, we wouldn't stay here, but we don't really have any other choice. This is their last room. We're on, we're on our way to the onsen place. Onsen for men. Bye. And I'm heading to the women's. Milk is one of the things I usually get after onsen. It's just, you know, kind of automatic that you have to get it to drink it after a warm bath. Staying in Ryokans, it's quite customary for you to put your shoes inside a shoe box. Shoe lockers. Like this one. Stayed here for the night, last night. It's, um, I think it's a branch of routine. And they have Hananoyu as well. Um, it was the last hotel that we could find here and it costs four times the price of a single room I usually stay at in Tokyo So that was not very cheap But yeah, it was good enough for the night thing We noticed here is that you know in Tokyo When you're riding an escalator you have to stay on the left But here in Akita you have to stay on the right side In Kobukta's car from Nissan rent a car. So for two days, is it? Yeah. Uh, the two days cost for rent a car is 16,044 no, 16, yen. So that's about half cent yen, 8,000 per day. This is gonna be a car. So when you're renting, renting a car here in Japan, they will usually give it to you with a full tank. And what you have to do is when you return the car, you have to return it full as well and you have to present a receipt to them when you return the car and as you can see Mika's like checking out scratches around the car that's also you know to keep us safe and also the car rental company just in case there are unknown scratches when we return them this one is very strange Miko had to ask um, the staff how to use this one Shippats! We're parking our car near Akita Dog Station so that we can have the chance to mingle with Akita dogs. And here, the parking costs 200 for the first hour, and then after that, every 30 minutes, every 30 minutes, we have to pay 100 yen. Akita. So this is what you see when you go to Akita Dog Station. We went here yesterday and they said the dogs were resting yesterday so they advised us to come back today. The dog looks happy so that's great. So if you intend to Akita Dog Station, this is what you're gonna be experiencing or witnessing. Actually, when we were walking yesterday, we met another person with his own Akita dog and it was so big. Much bigger than this dog. Akita dogs look very similar to Shiba, Shiba Inus. It's just that Akita are much bigger and there's an even smaller version of them which is Mame, Mame, Mame Shiba, which is even smaller. So all of them look almost the same, it's just the size varies. Inside Akita Dog Station, they also have a mini shop, such as this one. They sell rice, rice grains, made in Akita. It's 380 yen. And then they sell other things too, such as coffee. It's 
stationaries of these cute plushies for 1,980 yen. Also, instant ramen noodles for 291 yen. They also sell these treats for 421 yen. This is 330 yen. The flavor is tomato. Tartar dip salad. Oh, they have another rice here. Hachiko, komen, 497 yen. This is also rice. <laughs> this is the Akita dog station store where we just entered. And that's the Akita dog. Her name is Momo or his name is Momo. I'm not really sure if it's a female or male dog. Times when you can see the dog in Akita dog station is from 11 to 11.30 a.m. Then they rest, 12 to 10 until 1 p.m. rest, 1.30 till 2 p.m. rest, 2.40 to 3 p.m. then rest again. You know, I was expecting that we would have better contacts with Akita dogs in Akita dog station, but I'm actually pretty happy that they do it this way, that we just look at them from afar, so it doesn't stress the dogs as well. We went to Family Mart and this is what we're gonna be eating for breakfast because having his, what do you call this again? Onigiri. onigiri salmon onigiri, my jagabi. I drink some right there because we're having our veggie fruit drink. Also vitamin C and milk. Yeah, that's what we're gonna be eating in the car for breakfast. This is Mika's favorite vegetable drink because they advertise that they can provide you with one day's worth veggies and fruits as well or just veggies? Just veggies. Just veggies, what, what your body needs for one day. But I don't like the taste of this so much and I'll show you what's mine. This is what I get. It's fruits, mixed fruits and vegetables. So like this one. Um, I take a cult every day, but when we're traveling, it's hard to get a pack because it usually comes with a big pack Anyway, but yeah, I take this. It's one 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 bottle per day I also like to drink this vitamin lemon vitamin C drinks Of course, this is one of my most favorite Japanese snacks ever You should try this when you go to Japan. Jagabi Let's go Need to get tickets. Tickets cost 500 yen. This is probably one of the most important samurai houses here. Aoyagi Samurai House. Goes down, the sun comes up. I wake up slow. I wonder where you've gone. You left the ground oh, a while ago. I'm losing every sense of time You are a traveler We're here right now at Aoyagi Samurai House They used to be a samurai residence and now it's a museum It's probably Japan's most well-preserved samurai residence um, So just earlier today we were able to lift handle samurais. You can also try to put on a helmet here and carry or lift a kago carriage. So yeah, that's about it. This is how it looks like from the outside. Lots of green.
Does he look like a samurai to you now? <laughs> it's sword and stuff. For what? Sword and stuff. You need so a samurai sword. Mm -hmm. How do I look right now? Mm. <laughs> Is it too <twisted? laughs> funny? How do you look like that? <laughs> Don't, look, don't try to look so cute. Okay, it's that's not really fitting this outfit. <laughs> the traditional kago carriage used in the Edo Jedi period. Edo period. And Miko and I are gonna try to lift this. But we don't have a camera guy, so I'll try it here. And Miko's gonna try it from there. Ready? Oh! We did it! <laughs> done gently try to lift it up but please don't try to go inside it says here to go in in this cafe shop antique museum there are a few things being sold here such as this sakura designed um platito <gasps> cups for 770 yen cute owl designs for 550 yen design fans for 330 yen cute cat chopsticks holder for 490 yen so cute ramex first photos of akita doggo oh, wow. this part of this room these are all cameras there's so many of them. Seen this camera in the movies from 1934, Singlo brand. There's tons of them. This one is from 1931. The brand is Roly Flex. They used to be, this is a movie, movie player. From which year, Miko? It doesn't say. It doesn't say, but it looks really, really old. Really oldest, 1895 camera. It looks pretty modern, but it's 1903 camera. It's so small. That's a year before my grandpa was born. This explains it. So the masters of the Aoyagi family, they've collected these items, cameras, clocks, gramophones from many foreign countries because they were, they were deeply influenced by the Western culture, which was amazing to be open, so open-minded at that time. Went missing on a late night train and I left this tire on it from my brain. I'm a two-tone record but I just get lost and I find myself running from my thoughts and I Sakura Japanese style painting designs, incense stand holders here for only 550 yen, and also incense saucer. But I don't really like incense. In Ishiguro Samurai Residence, they offer this. That if you want to grow this, they will give you the seeds for free. You just have to tell the staff. So I think I'm gonna get. I'm gonna request for some seeds. And it, and the, its name is balloon vine or balloon plant or love in a puff. They're giving seeds for free right here. Box. 
This comes with an envelope where you can put in as well. <laughs> We're getting this one. It's so good. It's this one. 790 yen. It's 790 yen from Krisha. It's really delicious. You should go. Interesting design for a lamp. Very Japanese. Four souvenirs. 220 yen. 270 yen, 390. So, what is this one? Lemon sour? Lemon sour for 250 yen. Getting this sake plus yogurt drink. 6%? 7%? 7 alcohol. 600 yen. Very interesting shop. And you can sell this as well. Fish. It's very expensive. 1080 yen. Sell these masks here as well. 850 yen. 1100 yen. Traditional Japanese masks. We went here. If you have your sake needs, go here. We're here at the Shokan! Let's try to get in. This is called Kapazaiku Den Shokan, Cherry Bar Craftwork Museum where you can see Kaba art crafts. These are the dates and opening hours. Kids, it costs 300 yen each person for here, here in Den Shokan. Japan's deepest lake. Ko is preparing our drone. <laughs> so we're here right now at Mount Katamae Forest Park. They don't charge for parking, so it's and it's also free entry. Mount Katamae Forest Park is the only place around here where you can get a wide open view of Lake Tawaza. It's really good. It's free. There's also free parking. Drone registration number written on a band aid because we forgot to put a sticker on it. This is our mini drone. So beautiful.
seeing our shadow so we're here right now at Dakigairi Valley it means embrace according to Google they have free parking space it's been years since I've been gone I miss the way it feels to roam this urge that's grown in Inside my heart to pack my bags and hit the road I'm dreaming of the road again Set free in the wind Feels like we found home again On the road that's grown within means welcome we've made it here at Yudono-san Ryusuiji Dainichibo that was really long for me to pronounce but yes yay we're gonna be seeing living Buddhas right here I'm not sure if I will be able to take videos or photos but I'll try This was this has one eye.
heading back down from the temple. Miku is gonna meet me somewhere there. He's gonna park the car right there. It's so beautiful here. If you're coming by a car to Yamadera Temple and you're looking for a parking space, I recommend for you to just pick the closest parking space you can find because all of them cost 500 yen. Unlike in other places where, you know, sometimes it's cheaper and more expensive, it depends. But here it's always 500 yen, so just pick the closest one you can find. The Shakuji Mountain Trail start 270 meters away. If you eat at this restaurant, you can find cheaper parking. Only 300 yen. This is the start of the trail. Yamadera Temple, also known as Rishakuji. Let's do this! I think if I remember correctly, we have to make 1,100 steps. I'm not sure. We've made it. It's not done yet. The process is you have to bow twice, clap your hands twice at the same height of your chest, and bow twice again. Actually, bow once at the end. Yen. I think we'd ha we had that before. Mm. This magnificent tree. I don't know how old this is. It's really big. It takes an hour and a half to do this trail. All right, an hour and a half, but that's in total. Okay. Need to get tickets, go. Tickets here cost 300 yen per person. Yamadera temple tickets, 300 yen.
one yen. One yen. Somebody put one yen here and right here as well. Oh, ten yen. Another one yen. Queens, <laughs> five yen. Literal meaning mountain temple is the colloquial name for Rishakuji. It's also built in 9th century. Fun fact. <laughs> Chai version of the Bunshokam. There's the clock tower. Shopping Street. The start of Nanukamachi Goten Zaki. this while walking in Yamagata city. Look at this, instead of stairs, they put slide in here. A slide. It's so nice. Daiwa Roynet Hotel. Four star. This is where I'm gonna be staying at for the evening. This is the view from my floor. Hotel floor. Room number is 623, all the way to the end of the corridor. There's vending machine and microwave. Oh, it's right here. Room This is how much I paid at this hotel, 5,418. This is my hotel, and it's just right behind Daiwa Roynet Hotel. Very affordable. I'm getting this, 420 yen. I found this place, it's in Espal building, second floor. And also Hakata Hakata style is also just right there. Pokemon. So 
holy shit. It's so good. Got this from Hasaki Style. It's peach or momo shake. So good. I would have bought some cherries, but it's not in season right now. Grapes and peaches are in season right now. Look who's picking me up. <laughs> You're on a plane to Tokyo, to LA and to places I don't know And every time you're leaving home, I hate that but When you travel down the coast, when you look across the shore When you hear the ocean roar, I'm waiting for your call When you make it to the island, something's the same When I look at the horizon, well you think of me, you are traveling Taking off to Mexico, to Paris, and I know you long for.